how to build a list of book reviewers for free. Now, this was something that I used to charge for. It used to be a course called Book Reviews Made Easy. But I'm going to explain everything in that course in today's episode because I see a lot of people who are struggling to get book reviews. I remember reading a couple of years back that there was a website that used to charge it was like two or three hundred dollars to get one book review. Now, the way they marketed this service was that this book review you were going to get from this person was going to be far better than all the other book reviews you were going to get. But it was only one book review and you were paying over two hundred dollars for it. Which to me was absolutely crazy. Compared to the, the course that I was selling, I think I was selling my book reviews made easy. I think it was like twenty-seven, forty-seven dollars but in that I was going to show anybody how they could create a huge list of that so uh, to me somebody charging $300 for a book review was totally absolutely crazy now I'll go ahead and I'll explain how I did it now you can take notes of this again now before I go forward it this what I'm about to explain to you might have been against the terms and service of this website but there was nothing illegal in it I'm sure other people have done it in the past but it was very very easy okay you're probably saying get on with it stop waffling on right what I did was if you don't know there's a website called library thing now you'll need to do a Google search I can't I don't know the exact domain name of it but if you do library thing all one word you will find this website now what happens on this website is people offer copies of their books for free for in exchange for a review now what you can do when you become a member of a library thing at the last time I think to become a member of the site again it was something like Goodreads people would leave your views and talk about their favorite books so it was a kind of like a Goodreads kind of website if you don't know what it is but to become a member at the time I think it was like $15 for a lifetime access or $20 but it was next to nothing anyway so I paid my fee and I gave away some of my books for free now you can give away paperback books you can give however many copies you want to but you can also give away digital books and in my case the books I was writing that time were Kindle in the Kindle store so they were digital ones and if you are giving away digital books you can give up to a hundred copies away in exchange for a review now when it comes to setting up your your uh, your book giveaway you can set it to maybe you can put a time limit on it that people have to respond within a couple of days or you can leave it open for maybe two or three weeks or something like that so over those two or three weeks people will put their name down and say yes I would be interested in getting a copy of that book um, and what you can do is when you're doing your book giveaway you can say in the description that this book has been given away in exchange for an honest review now a lot of people will give their books away for free on that site and then they will expect book reviews to come back from them now not everybody that you give those books away to will leave a review you will get some people probably who are freebie seekers who are probably just filling their hard drive or just reading the books themselves and they're not interested in helping anybody out and they're not interested in leaving a book review but you will find people who do take that job seriously and will leave a review for your book so if you do give a hundred copies of your book away you might find maybe 20 maybe 30 now again this has been a couple of years back the numbers may be a little bit less than now I don't know exactly but you would find that people would leave a review and they would do it completely free so if you were a budding author now with your first book you could come out the gates straight away it would probably having 10 or 15 reviews on maybe the first week release of your book now an easy way of giving away the free books was to tie it into your book promotion if you are selling your books in the Amazon Kindle store you're probably well aware of the free promotion days where you can set a free promotion up on your book and you can give free copies away so what you would do is you would notify all the people in the library thing that your book was free between maybe the second to the fifth of this month and they had to race over there they had to download a copy because that's when it was free and then it would go back to being a paid book again so Kindle done all the work for you you would just direct that person over you would just say here that um, you've won a free copy of my book review if you want to download a copy go straight over the Amazon Kindle store now download a copy and then if you could please leave me a book review on the Amazon Kindle store that would be fantastic but as I said not everybody will do that but if you got your 
your list of a hundred book reviewers or people who are interested in reviewing your book what you can do is library thing will actually send you the email addresses of those people who have requested your book so what you do is you when the competition is over or your you know your 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 thing has counted down you simply just get all those people's emails and send it off to them and send here's the book here's all the details download the book now as I said you will get some book reviews from that but something that I did that I think a lot of people probably wouldn't even think of doing sorry I just had to wipe that camera off there the rain's coming down what I did was I had said in that first email now again you can't spam these people you can't email them over and over again but what I did was I had said my book is for free would you please give it a book review and while I'm here would you be interested in getting any more free copies of my book for future reviews now I don't know about you if you were a library thing fan and maybe you are a big fan of romance books somebody was giving you a free romance book to review for free now if you like that kind of genre you probably would download that book give it a review but if that author said to you you know something I want to give you all my next books for free if you would just simply keep doing what you're doing I'm sure that person would love the chance of getting more of those romance books for free in exchange for simple review so what I did was I collected or sent that email out ask people if they would like to continue along being a book reviewer for my future books and if they would respond, respond to me and say yes or no now again you'll have a hundred people not everybody will respond to you but you will find people who are maybe fanatics of romance or whatever niche you're in and they would love to get your next book for free so basically what I did was I kept all those names and then when my second book came out I simply just emailed them all off and I said my second book's out for free would you download it now today and give me a book review so over time as I started doing more and more promotions on library thing I started getting new lists of people who I would ask in that email if they would want to review any future books so I was slowly over time building a huge list of book reviewers now this became so great that not only could I get book reviews at the push of a button I simply just hit the email sent it off to those people got them to read the book got them to review it but at one stage I actually had people helping me edit my book because over time as they got to know me and built a relationship with them I started to develop my own street team and these were people who liked my books wanted to help me out wanted to be part of the process so I found that some people would actually read back through my books I found one lady at one time would actually edit my books she would point out all the mistakes I made all the grammar mistakes and she would highlight them for me now you can take this too far you can you know get people to do loads of things for nothing but you will find if you do develop a relationship with those people that you can actually get them to help you out and they like they like feeling part of your writing process they feel like they are contributing to your career if they get to know you and get to like you and you can develop your own street team so when it comes to any future books not only can they can you get them to review your book but you can also get them maybe to touch reach out to their friends and family or Facebook groups or whatever and ask them if they would maybe promote your book in that way as well too so not only are they reviewing your books but they're also helping you to promote them as well so if you are struggling right now to you know to get book reviews go to a website like that library thing or go to a Facebook page or something like that of a group that would be interested in your book and explain to them that you're giving away free copies on a certain day and if somebody could send you an email and you will let them know exactly where they can pick the book up on the day and then what you do then is reach out to them again when the book is due to be released and ask them whether they be interested in reviewing any future books get all the rest of your books for free from now on and as you can imagine a lot of people jump at the chance to get you know more books for free and all you're looking for is a review in exchange for that and as I said when it comes to your next book your second book third book fourth book you don't have to go begging or crawling to somebody looking for book reviews you simply just hit the button send off your email to your list and then you will find the book reviews will come back in on autopilot so give that a go again I'm not too sure if that is against the terms and conditions of library thing but you don't even have to use library thing go to where people are willing to read copies of your book give copies away in exchange for email, for book reviews and then put them on an email list and you know 
go back again and again and again for any future books. So you will find that is a lot cheaper and a lot better than paying some website two or three hundred to get two or three hundred dollars to get one book review, whereas you have all those people on tap and you could do it all completely for free. So give that a go if you if you are struggling with book reviews. I did find it very very helpful and I found I met a lot of nice people who again as I said were willing to even go even further than book reviews and were actually going to help me with my editing and everything of my books as well too so it's well worth doing it so if you'd like to know more about me or you'd like to know more where these videos and podcast episodes are you're very welcome to do a search for writecom that's w-r-i-t-e-c-o-m-e dot com and you'll find them all over the web and if you go to the writecom site right now you have a great free report that is going to show you how to go from words to wealth and in that free report i'm going to show you 10 ways you can make money from your words and you don't even need to be a writer to do half of them or probably at least nine of them so as always if you'd like to download that free report i challenge you to read through it and if you don't come up with at least one money making idea reach out to me and let me know you can find me at barryjmcdonald at gmail.com and you can tell me what you thought of the free report so as always thanks for sharing your time again today take care and have a great day bye bye